Dundee United have been slipping steadily down the standings and having once appeared odds on for a top eight place in their maiden DSTV Premiership season, they've now slipped into the bottom half for the first time since match day two. Oh, it's a strong challenge in the middle of the park by Sien Ledwaba and Ohizu trying to get away from Denwin Farmer st here. Still Ohizu. The ball breaks to Yusuf Mart, who fires it with venom and then tapped home. The easiest of finishes. Written all over, and you thought this, but again, clever work from Pachi on the side. Oh, lovely ball. That's brilliant. Ohizu. Can he get out of his feet? Still Ohizu. Forced the strike. Oh, brilliant. Splendid finish from the Nigerian. Well, he ends a dry spell that stretches months back in the finest of fashion. And Skukuni United have a two-goal lead on their own patch. Now oh, Patlele's throw has fallen here for Sitole and eventually another shot fired in from the edge of the area and Nick Hebrotz has gone for it and that was always just drifting wide. Well, 30 minutes in there can be no complaints over the uh, the spectacle, the action that we've seen so far. Now they still haven't got this clear, have Skakuni United. It's about a thought about coming for it. And eventually it's away. Something for Justin Shonga to chase. He does have pace. Now Justin Shonga collects. Still he goes on, assessing his options here. Plays it over to Yusuf Mart. Ohizu. Need to do something with it. Pachi! Flashes that over the crossbar. Now opportunity for the cross and a diving header from Justin Shonga. That materialized out of nowhere. The loose ball just uh, broke beautifully to uh, Kagwe out on the left. Good work from Kagwe. And look at the improvisation from Shonga. Had he got that touch he was looking for, who could have been talking a different story. It's for Patlele to back into here. A 22 year old is still able to get that throw a decent distance. Now he's on hand to fling it across as so away by Jima. Big opportunity here for Skakuni United now. And the ball well released. Oh, off his line. Oh! oh, my goodness. It's one of the most bizarre goals you'll ever see, but Ohizu has his second. And surely Baraka are dead and buried now. Now they launched a devastating break. Chepezeze read it to his credit and came off his line as swiftly as he could manage. But a terribly unkind ricochet has resulted in Skukuni's third. And their defenders look absolutely demoralized. They say you create your own luck. by Edwin Jima. And the last time that uh, Baraka conceded three was earlier this season, but on that day it was 3-2 against Le Mans for Golden Arrows. Which Lumbulu was... Oh! Well shot from Klala. Not particularly well held, but... Uh, Oh, the ball in is excellent, and Richard Mbulu has struck the woodwork with his header. Oh, that could have been the lifeline that they so desperately needed. As Kukuni United break at pace, how cruel it would be if they get another hand, they do. Well, Baraka comes so close at the other end. Put it away with a plum. The jubilation, the joy from the Skukune bench, it's something they wanted. One man that needed to break the duck. 
it's a mobile since he joined yeah. Skukune. He has been scored. First goal of the season for Mube, who has been prolific with his uh, former club, so a credit to him for finally getting on the score sheet. Well, Skukune United opened the scoring through Davidson just.